ourselves uh, with Crystal Palace, they obviously lost to Southampton there, one nil. Uh, we'll just do a kind of quick run down through the games. Mm -hmm. uh, Southampton, one nil. I don't think you know uh, any of us were kind of really that bothered by by the game. I think a lot of people do like some of Palace's players and would like to see them stay up, mm -hmm. just because they have some young good players like Zaha, Townsend, mm -hmm. you know Ben Teke and these sort. Of well, they, they have good players going forward. Like, I just. I don't see how in four games you can let a, a man change philosophy or change you know change the way you want your club to play. I the think, mindset. Too, I yeah. think your man Parrish is very deluded and he's like Simon Jordan before. They're very they think they know yeah. everything about the football about the football club and how it should be run and they're too overpowering to actually yeah. let the manager take control. And I hate it. It's going to cost them though. Oh, the arrogance is ridiculous. The, between him and the, the man Parrish are just. I can't stand them. And Palace is a great club, great yeah. fans. Yeah, sure, mate, 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 was a, mate was from the Irish uh, Eagle Sports Club. He was in, in here and he was going mad about Paris. Yeah, he yeah. wouldn't back the manager. And not, then, not properly, anyway. But it, it, it's a good club. You know, you're haggling over 4 million on summer for Sacco. Got for 26. We won't, wouldn't pay 30. Still think that's crazy money for him. Yeah, but Oxley and Chamberlain score player at 35 million. So. Yeah, well, there you go. Had to go on right, yeah. Um, a, a club we kind of wanted to talk about is starting to do well of late is uh, Newcastle. Mm. Uh, mm. Since Benitez was at home playing FIFA with the lads, um, they yeah. seem to be doing well. Uh, the last settles is quality, like he's a proper leader, Pro proper yeah, one. Newcastle good, been good player, good uh, Been lacking, I know. But the only thing is, I'd be worried that they're sent a half score all their goals. <laughs> well, it's just a thing. Like I thought they were going to struggle because of the lack of. Signings, you know, yeah, well, yeah, yeah but there's a lot of talk saying that Rafa was going to leave, and there was all that sort of talk. Yeah, like, mm. look, they'll do what they'll do all right this year, you know. But they can't see them getting top six or anything like that, but I think they, they'll do all right, like, and because they have you know, they have a manager who'll make them up hard to beat, I suppose, and they'll be organized. He needs to, I mean, I think Mike actually said in the summer, I can't compete with City, but you're not competing with City, you're, you need to be competing with West Ham. Clubs yeah, like, clubs got, West Ham are trying to bid what, 30 40 million for Carvalho. Newcastle, sure, you can go out and buy players for at least 15 to 20 million with the money that's there at the moment. Yeah. So to say you can't bid, it's easy as well. Yeah, but that money these days doesn't get you much. Like, if you're, if you think about it, if you want to make a, obviously at Newcastle, you want to make a push up that table. I'd imagine they'd be finishing around anywhere from 12. I'd say in around twelfth anyway. I'd say they'll probably land up in the twelfth or up is a is a um, it's positive. Yeah, you did, did look. If you ask any Newcastle fan, they'd probably say, look, just stay so up I and maybe run in the cup. Do you know what I mean? Like, there's there's a club that's out. No, <laughs> but that's a club that's over Geo Trophy. Do you know what I mean? They uh, they they value the yeah, other another fantastic club yeah. again that should never really went down in my opinion. Why yeah. are they fantastic? Newcastle. Yeah, they've got great the the team themselves. Like you look looking back, like look at Anagera, like the whole lot that's gone on. They've had good challenges for the title, you know. I liked like, them when they had Bobby Robson in charge. Yeah, he's yeah. another guy. It's kind of hard not to like him. Oh, of course, yeah, yeah. Like it's a good city, and they get behind the team and stuff like that. But yeah, they need they do need to win something. But I don't see why in the summer they couldn't go and buy someone like Shane Long. Do you know what yeah, I mean? So yeah, 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 sign but would, would Shane Long, Long not be quite similar to Dwight I think yeah. it's better than the way Gale. But, yeah, yeah but it's similar. Who, but who, I, who's I more proven in the Premier League? But Shane has done it for a long time in the Premier League. He started there. Shane, he's a, I suppose he's an impact player, but he, if he played Don't get me wrong, I love Shane Long. Yeah, of course. Uh, like, you know. Of course we do, but like, we all do. Yeah, we all like Shane Long, I, mean, I suppose. I think he would do a job for a club like Newcastle, do you know what I mean? To play off someone with the pace, play off the shoulder. I think a lot of teams are lacking pace at the moment. But I think just... I mean, eight million probably would have done the job, eight nine million, and then, you know, they would have they would have, at least guaranteed themselves something that they could even bring off the bench to have some sort of impact, you know, that way. Which I think that that that's where they might fall down. Yeah. Bit, you know? My only argument would be Joy Kyle's quite similar to him. That would be my kind of only. Yeah. Like, like there's, not, <coughs> there's not too much between them. I mean, if if Joy Kyle was Irish, we'd, we'd, we'd take him, wouldn't we? So. Of course, yeah, we take anyone. <laughs> that's anyone, anyone. probably not him because anyone will help. Yeah. Anyone that has Irish granny, they can come along. That's it, Josh. Clinton Morrison. Yeah, I'd still do a job. Yeah, probably. Um, we're kind of we'll fly through uh, some of the games and with West Brom and West Ham. Mm. Uh, nil nil still, mate. Again, 
és uh, rájönnek Ben Foster és Iman Sentov, Kung Floyd, Kácsi mm-hmm. Hernández, um, but there were still two defenders covering in behind, so we yeah. got yellow. Uh, they were calling for a red, and even even Billich was like doing that with the car and everything like that. I, I hate to see that, so I kind of yeah, the influence of refs. So. No, he's down to the fourth official. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But, uh, you're gonna see a lot of the, the pace of the game now. It's it's so quick. You're gonna see a lot of these one v ones, keepers coming out. A lot of these kind of incidents, I suppose. It's that's how quick the Premier League is at the moment, and it's it's hard for referees to be fair. Yeah, to make them kind they of should really get that assistant video assistant referee. They should. Yeah, he says slows down the game. A lot of critics. I think referees can take a lot of stick. I know, don't think anyone will mind though if it was a few extra minutes of. It's, like it's just 30 seconds, yeah, really. Like, isn't it? If it's a goal, it'd be like lovely. It's only quickly yeah. like that, like, and it, it'll only be lent in a game by maximum of like three minutes extra. Or something. Well, like, I mean, for the sake it, of that. If you see it in rugby, it, it, doesn't, it, does it doesn't seem to, it doesn't seem to stop the pressure. Flow, yeah, but right, once, right. once they kind of get used to it, it wouldn't slow the game down there too no, much. No, yeah, it'll just be natural. It'll just be, I'd say the first couple of things could be dodgy, and then after that, it's one. Sure, hockey do it, rugby do it, all these sort of types of sports. Seems, seems to work, but yeah. Uh, West Ham, yeah, th- again, I mean, they went out with football players like Hernandez and stuff like that, but I just don't seem to think they, they play to their strengths. Yeah, know? do they put balls in the six yard box across that's, the That's where he'd score, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. He, he's no good when back to goal, getting long balls. And no, and it, that's why Sonado struggled to score, he was a six yard player, you know what I mean? And if you don't give him the service, he's not going to score. And I think that's like that with Lukaku, if you don't give him the ball in the six yard box, he's not going to score. So. Exactly, yeah. And so hopefully. Hernandez stays like that for another, at least another week or two. So mm-hmm. to that for you is playing. Exactly. Yeah, uh, I suppose that the only real, other real game that we haven't spoken about is Huddersfield and Leicester. Mm-hmm. One all draw. Um, again, I was saying beforehand. Good. Steady start for Huddersfield. Good. Yeah. Hopefully they do well. I mean, if I was a Huddersfield fan, I'd, I'd be happy with that result. Yeah. I over mean, the, over the moon. Yeah. Yeah. Leicester, when they turn it on, they are very good. Yeah, when they play, like when they play to their strengths with over the top of Verdi and, and you know when they get the ball to Maris, you know they their their team looks to play in the bright. But even that, like Christian Fuchs is a very good player as well. Yeah, I was raging. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think he's a bit. He's a bit. He's a bit of a YouTube player. I don't know. I, I don't. I wouldn't rate him too much as a, as a defender. This is a new term, is it? Yeah, YouTube players. Yeah, yeah, that's the, the modern no, era. Have player. good, have good highlights. Yeah, highlight real <laughs> players. You know what I mean? Yeah, so, yeah, no, I get you. But. Uh, yeah, one of those players comes from Russia, YouTube because you've never heard of them. Yeah, and, and then, you say, then you say, then you say, yeah, I'm watching it for you. Who might need us? Prime example. Good player, to be fair. Nice no, not. He's, not good. he's had a good season last year. Um, he's back in the squad. He was in the away end actually. I'll let you. I'll let you do something. Yeah, well, we'll see. We'll see. He's, he seems to be scoring during twenty three, isn't he? But yeah, yeah, Barry got a penalty or scored a penalty. Sorry. Hmm. Smashed the home. Yeah. Still, I still, I, I'm still laughing at the people that tell me he was better than Kane. I'm going to laugh at that. Did I say that too? No, 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 no. But what people did, but yeah. <laughs> I did say, look, the Akko was better than Kane. They're uh, uh, Well, that was debatable last year. There yeah, at least that was neck and neck, like, you know what I mean? Yeah, but I don't think so anymore. And not just because he left, I just... Yeah. When Kane was so far behind in the golden boot, and then he came... And he missed a quarter of the season. And he, But he showed hunger to actually go and win it. Yeah. Lukaku just... Yeah, even the last day, like... Yeah, he was to go and score a hat trick and then score four it was against Leicester. Yeah, uh, but he just showed he's like, all right, Lukaku, like, you're you're not asked. You didn't do it for the last fourteen games or something. Fuck you. And then he finished ahead of you, and that, that, that shows the difference in in, in the hunger. Yeah, uh, for me. But yeah, uh, Vardy penalty. Yeah, he just he's just one of them. He just smashed the home. Yeah. He'll get he'll get ten to fifteen again this season. I'd say probably. Yeah. yeah, I think he should have went somewhere in the summer. He had that chance. I think when he. Like I, don't well, think he he, I don't see a great option for him. If he's I would have loved him on us. Yeah, yeah maybe, yeah. He's probably what, probably what you need. He is exactly what we need. Yeah. Really slipping him in. Yeah, like, that's the thing. The only thing is, if you're paying 30 plus million for a 30, yeah, 30 yeah, 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 yeah. one. I don't know if you paid him now, yeah, but last year you probably would have paid it, yeah. But well, not this year. No, nah, not this year. He's probably too old. He would have gone for 20 anyway, I'd say, maybe this year. Yeah. I don't know. I'd say less or one to hold on to him pretty tight as well, though. What's that? For the sake of a set, I'd say. Lesser would want to hold on to Vardy, like, mm-hmm. just well, yeah, he's best years behind him now, so yeah, I think like he'll, 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 he'll have another couple of years in the Premier League, but oh, sure, look, he's a Premier League man, <laughs> yeah, it's an unbelievable season. So, we won't go there, yeah, I don't want to go there either, <laughs> rough times, 
Um, yeah, all right. Well, I suppose that that's been uh, all the games we've kind of covered them all there. Uh, that's been our Premier League show. Thank you very much for watching Irish Football Fan TV. Thanks again to the lads for coming on. No problem. Um, no. Check them out. Their uh, Twitter uh, handle will be under their names if you want to check them out. Sure. Thanks for watching.